Hey guys, it's JT. Welcome back. Episode number 13. And right where we left off, we are going to go down. And uh, as you can see, um, I'm Iron Man now. Uh, we are going to go back into the nether now that we have full health and hunger is no longer a factor. And we are going to... That bunny scared me. We're going to go grab our stuff. And yeah, I was totally freaking out um, last episode um, because I failed to realize <laughs> that uh, you cannot starve. Um, we should have plenty of inventory space. You cannot starve to death on easy mode. Now let's see, where was that chest at? Right over there, I think, is our pillar. We gotta go down here. Yeah, that's right. We came up by this torch, didn't we? Um. So. Yeah. Oh, I started to say, as you can see, I'm Iron Man. Um. Because I am home this morning. Um. Actually, I was home last night for whatever re reason. The game did not pick up the fact that I was uh, logged in online whenever. Um, Whenever I was playing, there it is. Uh, the game, and it left me as Steve, uh, so I didn't really address it. But um, let's get all of our stuff. I, I like to pick it up like this so that it doesn't drop stuff off there. Whenever I. Uh, uh, Okay, um, where's my sticks? Those go up there. Um, my bow. I have three arrows left. Sword, pick, axe. I did get a gas tier while I was wandering around there last night. Uh, I didn't mention that in the other video. Um, had a couple ghasts uh, attack me before the one that, <laughs> um, before the one that we uh, were being chased by when I uh, had you guys join me uh, there towards the end of the video after one of my uh, those times when I cut out um, I guess I'll just yeah. and there went that axe again I think that's the last time it's gonna take it yep that's it okay well Let's go back over here. We're going to get out of this place. This is crazy. Um, we need a, we need another pick is what we need. Um, I don't want to waste my diamond pick uh, going through the... Oh, get up there. Going through Netherrack. Um, so, we will come back after we get some new diamond picks. Um, and we will go back to that, uh, it's that way, not that way. I think I did see one, and I think I was over there, and I, th excuse me, I thought I was over there. I had a hiccup. Um. But. Alright, let's, I have carrots in my inventory. I don't. Okay, let's go in this way. We're gonna go in the house. We're gonna sleep through the night. Um. And then when we get up, we're going to make new tools. So, <clears throat> yeah, um, apparently I was not ready to do all that journeying into the nether. Finish off that bread. We do have to get some food today. That's that's one thing we need to do for sure. Uh, let me throw that. Well, I guess I'm just going to throw it there for now. Um, let's see here. I got uh, the paper. We're going to actually, yep, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go chop down that wood like I said we were. That's what we're going to do. Um, let's see. All this stuff can go in the ingredients box. Um, I'm going to leave these mushrooms here. 
Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put, put them in the food box. Let's throw these in here. Um, this can go in here, and let's see. Oh, I have two of them now. That's right. Okay. Well, we'll put them both in there. Right, put this chest down. Put this over here. Um, yeah, we'll get organized here real quick, and this is what I wanted to put that there, I guess. I have one steak in my box. We're going to have to go, uh, breed some animals, harvest some wheat and carrots. Um, as a matter of fact, you know what, that's, that's what I'm going to eat for the time being. I'm going to take about half of these carrots. That's what I'm going to fill up on. Um, so we have glowstone. And we have some gunpowder. I don't... Oh, wait. Here we go. I thought I had other gunpowder. Nether, nether wart is like the most important ingredient to making uh, potions. Um, we need the mushroom and the spider eye along with some sugar to make uh, the... the uh, I'm drawing a blank here, guys. The fermented spider eye, so that we can make the potions of splash po and along with gunpowder to make splash potions of weakness to convert zombie villagers to regular villagers and start trading. Um, at some point, we will have to build a place to capture and keep uh, those guys. Um, let me see. I'm gonna throw this bone in here. I turn it into bone meal. I don't. Yeah, I do have them here. Let's take those to the other chest. Um, I do have some rotten flesh I could eat, but I really don't think I want to do that. Um, let's see, let's put, yeah, let's put these over here, and, uh, I think I'm going to put this chest here by my crafting table. I don't, hmm, See, I know this is going to be for Lapis. This is going to be for Enchanted Books. Um, I think I'm going to put a chest here. This is stuff that's waiting to be uh, used. Oh, we need tools. That's what we need. Give me uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, and we'll make a new shovel too and fix that up. Um, Okay, so let's, oh, you know what, uh, I've only, I'm not going to do the shovel yet, I've only got enough sticks to make the two pickaxes, so we'll just carry that iron around for a while, I guess, uh, give me this, and let's get, let's start out with an unbreaking, because those are hard to get, and then let's go with efficiency. We should have enough levels left to... That's not what I want. That's what I want. To combine those, we have one level, and I don't think it mattered. Well, that way it takes two. Okay, to add... The unbreaking enchantment costs more levels, so to add it to this pick costs two levels, but to add efficiency one to an unbreaking pick only costs one, so that's what we want to do. Um, Alright, even though we're not even going to be using our pick right now, I am not ready to go back in the nether this episode. Um, I mean, not that I'm not physically prepared to, I'm just not, um, not wanting to go back in there just yet. Um, just because of the experience that I just had. <laughs> um, yes, I know. I freaked out for nothing over the, um, the whole starving thing. Um, my bad. But it just makes you not, not quite ready to go back. And I fell down in here again. How many more? There we go. Okay. Did 
Let's go up here. Up here. And come here, little bunny rabbits. Oh, wow. They're all excited. I don't think I'm able to breed them yet because of the time. Maybe I'm not. Oh, okay. I was up too high. There we go. Okay. I don't know that I need that second gate, but we're going to leave it there anyway. Um, I'm honestly not sure why we're saving the seeds, but we are anyway. Um, throw that iron back. Alright guys, um, tell you what, um, I don't really have anything I feel I need to discuss at the moment, so what I am going to do is go ahead and... Um, Basically, just go through here and cut down a crap ton of trees, and I will uh, probably just go until my axe breaks. Um, all the birch is going to get turned into charcoal. All the oak is going to get used for, uh, and I may use the birch for the sticks. Um, all the... Uh, because I, I don't like the birch wood. I, th I think it's ugly. I don't, I don't... I mean, maybe I'll eventually find a use for it that I like. But as of right now, I don't have one. So we're going to turn all the birch into charcoal. Um, we're going to keep all the oak wood that I cut. We're going to walk around here and look for apples. Um, well, you know what? I don't have to cut out. I, I can... I can talk about some uh, things here. Future plans for... Um, game um so i think what we're gonna do is after after this um we're gonna go back to the nether um we're gonna get into that nether fortress and explore it we're going to try to get uh blaze rods um And here, here's the reason for that. What's gonna, what we're gonna do is, when we are in there with the blaze rod, getting blaze rods. When I find a blaze spawner, um, what that's gonna do is give us a whole bunch of levels. Um, and then, since we'll have all this wood to make the bookshelves with, that's the other thing we're gonna use the birch for is bookshelves. Actually, we'll probably do that before. There's a rabbit on top of a tree. Um, We'll, uh, we'll do the bookshelves, and then then we'll make charcoal out of the rest of it. Um, and fill our furnaces up with charcoal so they're ready to go. Oh, he fell down. Any chance you'll give me a rabbit's foot? I'll let you go for now. <laughs> um... So what, what we'll do is then when we come back from the nether with all those levels from killing blazes and whatever else we find, we will be able to do a high level enchant on our diamond pick and try to get fortune. Then after that, we will go back down into that cave and get those diamonds that you probably thought I forgot about. <laughs> I didn't forget. Actually, for a little bit, I did. Um, <laughs> that's another thing I was reminded of when, uh, whenever my son was watching my videos, um, uh, when he was in the truck with me this past weekend. Um, yeah, so it's good to go back and watch your own videos <laughs> once in a while, I guess. Um, well, he was watching, I was listening while I was driving, but anyway, um, so yeah, we're, we're gonna go, uh, back down and get those diamonds once we get a fortune pick. Um, hopefully we'll get fortune three. Um, we're getting a bunch of apples here. Well, three. Um, yeah, that's a bunch compared to how many apples you normally can find. <laughs> like, if if you've ever watched um, anybody play UHC, like, I watched the Minecrackers play UHC. Um, Is that you making that noise? 
It sure is. You were stuck or something. Um, when you play on UHC and they, they turn hunger or uh, health regen off from the hunger, and basically your option is to, for health regen, is to go down and mine gold and make golden apples. Well, they hardly ever get drops of apples from trees. Um, I don't know why that is, if it's just the coincidence from <laughs> all the seasons I've watched of them, or if, those are different looking rabbit I just saw, it's all brown and not, like, doesn't have black eyes and stuff. Um, but yeah, I, I, I tend to see more apple drops, uh, in the games I play, and like I said, I play it on easy, um, And I tell you what, if I hadn't had it on easy, we would have died in the nether. No questions asked. We would have died. Um, so, I don't know. I I guess at some point, I'll tell you what, this series, this, this entire Let's Play series, until we end this series, and I don't know when that will be, um, maybe... When the like 1.9 update comes out, we will make a final episode where we will go into the end and kill the Ender Dragon and do all that. Um, I'm gonna have to kill those zombies because they're not gonna leave me alone. Get out of my face, Skelly. Um, we will, uh, when we're ready to start a new series, um, based on when, what updates are out at whatever given time, um, we will go to the net, uh, the end, like I was saying, before that mob severely interrupted me, there's a white bunny rabbit. We will um, kill the Ender Dragon. Um, we'll uh, do the final end game stuff. We'll get the Dragon Egg, and uh, I'm I'm not really in a big hurry to do that. And you know what? Actually, little tidbit here, trivia fact. Uh, I did not kill my first Ender Dragon, and I've been playing this game for a couple of years, um, and played on many maps, started new worlds, and um, for whatever reason, I never went to the end. I had found end portals. I'd never gone there. Um, you know, I'd found strongholds. I never made it really a point to find a stronghold. Um, I just never went to the end. Up until earlier this year, um, for the first time, I went to the end, killed the Ender Dragon, and got the egg. Um, the thing is, right now, basically, unless I mean, the only reason to do that is, yeah, you get get the egg, you, you have your trophy, but as far as the game goes, and because your world doesn't just end when you kill the end dragon, um, I mean, yeah, credits roll, but you go right back into your world and you keep playing, um, and yeah, you've got, if you don't screw it up by trying to pick it up wrong, then yeah, you get the end, uh, dragon egg, and, um, you got your trophy, but it doesn't really change anything. Like when you, if you go into the nether, and this is something we'll do eventually. You go in the nether and you get uh, a couple wither skeleton heads after you kill about five dozen of them because they drop so rarely. Um, that will net you a, the ability to spawn a wither and you kill it, it gives you another star, and you can make a beacon. A beacon has purpose. You can build a pyramid to set it on top of, out of the, um, iron, gold, diamond, emerald blocks, 
and it will give you a bonus that changes the game. Gives you a safe area where you have um, better health regen, speed boost, you know, whatever you choose for your bonus. And that and what you can choose depends, of course, on how big you build your little pyramid. Um, but... I need to eat. Oh, wow. Um, but it changes the game. It gives you an area that is different from the rest of the map. The only thing really you can do in the end, yeah, I guess you could get end stone and build with it in the overworld, which I've never done. Um, so I don't know, maybe we'll do that. Um, maybe we'll build something with that at the end, at, at some point. I don't know. But, um,. The thing is that, uh, let's swap that out for dirt, we're getting a nice little pile of wood here, um, yeah, okay, you could do that, um, the other thing you could do is farm endermen and get a whole bunch of ender pearls, um, you can, which I'm, I'm not a, huge fan of using ender pearls. I don't know why. I just well for one, I mean, it, they can get you killed if you're not careful with them. <laughs> so if you miss your target and you hit a wall on the side of a cliff and it drops you down, you know, 30 blocks and unless you got feather falling four diamond boots on, you know, you're likely to die. Um but so I'm not a huge fan of using the ender pearls. I, I get what I need from mob drops, uh, normal, you know, in caves or whatever, uh, enough to, um, let's see, did we get all the wood out of this tree yet? Let's use this instead of, I think I see them despawning, so yeah, let's work our way back to our pyramid, our pillar here. Uh, I get enough of them to do what I need to do to find the stronghold and fix the, and I think I've come down in this cave a bunch of times now. Yeah, this is the same one. Same cave. I'm going to leave the torch there so I remember that I've been here. I don't know why I have uh, the thing about taking my torches out of that cave when I come out of it. Um, but anyway, uh... So yeah, we're, um, I'm not, I'm not in a big hurry, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm, what I'm trying to get at is I'm not in a big hurry to go to the end, basically. Um, I'm not going to build a, uh, Ender Ender, um, in this series to, mob uh, to farm um enderman mobs and get tons of ender pearls if i want levels i can basically go out at night and kill zombies and skeletons and creepers and such um you know i'll build new armor and get some enchantments as needed um if, if we want to make a mob grinder we'll hopefully find a uh, dungeon at some point with a decent spawner in it that we can use um, to get get some XP fairly quickly um, you know so I'm not or see oh he's right in front of my face Wow sucker all right um so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and finish up harvesting the rest of these trees until my uh, you know what what's local here in the area until my axe breaks. Um, I'm gonna call this an episode right here, guys. I know it got a little talky. We didn't do much. Um, we basically went and got our stuff back and started cutting trees down. Um, 
but I think I've been rambling on now for enough time to fill an episode up. I hope it, uh, at least my uh, topics were um, uh, gives you an idea of where I'm going with this series, and if, I hope you like the sound of it anyway. Uh, if if not, maybe, I don't know, maybe you want to see me build things like the, the Ender Ender Ender, or, which, by the way, is, I did not come up with that name, that's uh, somebody else's, the first time I heard it was uh, on Minecraft, um, um, I heard Good call it that, and uh, it's basically just you build a mob farm in the end for Enderman, um, and there's different ways to do it, um, and when we do stuff like that, if I build something that is basically a copy of something somebody else has built, I will give them credit. I will link you to their video that uh, shows you how they did it, and I may do it exactly like they did. I may modify the, the, uh, the build to suit whatever materials I would rather use. Um, but I will give credit where credit's due. Um, so, yeah, um, I don't think we need these little, little spots of dirt there. Um, so yeah, anyway, uh, I know we didn't do a whole lot in this episode, um, but... Yeah, so hopefully, and I'm, I'm repeating myself now, <laughs> uh, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed it, so if you did, leave a like, if, if not, um, you know, uh, but please remember, uh, share the video, share my channel, um, you know, help us get, uh, reach our goal of a thousand subscribers, um, and yes, that's a very lofty goal at this point, um, but as soon as we do that, um, we will be giving away games, no questions asked. Um, and you know, once once my channel has gotten big enough to the point where I am making some money from it, I'm not I'm not gonna lie. That that is a lot of the a lot of the reason I'm doing this, I'm making the videos, because I'm perfectly happy just playing the game. But um, a lot of the reason that I'm making the videos is to have generate an extra source of income and as soon as the channel is will pay for the game giveaways um we can uh give away games a lot more often than you know i'm not going to get to a thousand subscribers and say okay I've, I've made enough money to buy a game we're going to give this one away and then my next goal is going to be 10,000 it's not going to be that high um, as long as the channel is is generating enough money to at least pay for the games I'll give away games fairly regularly um, it's I don't know it's an idea I got from uh, another YouTuber that I watched it uh, said he was going to start doing game giveaways um, for the series. Well, that series ended, so so did the giveaways. But um, it's uh, let's fill this hole in here. I don't like it. I think it's one a hole from a creeper blast from before. Maybe not. Maybe it was just there. But anyway, um. Alright guys, I'm, I'm done rambling, I promise. Um, and I think we're probably going to build something up here later, but I don't know what. Um, so, with that, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.